selfish, I guess. We'll still be together though, won't we, Lavi? Yeah. So when the skies quiet back down again and we figure out a way to get our van ship fixed up, you're gonna come back to being my navigator like before, won't you? Mm. You keeping everything running will really give me some peace of mind. Even if I am gonna be out there somewhere flying a van ship in the middle of some battle. Hey, Lavi, the next time that you and I fly together, it's gonna be when we're ready to cross the Grand Stream. That's a promise. All right. A promise. Are the fireworks over now? Maybe. What'll we do? If the lights stay out like this, we'll never find our way back. Oh. I've been looking for you. You need a hand, don't you? I'll give you a tow back to your ship. You can fly? I can see. We have equipment for such things. Handy, huh? But Klaus... There's no other choice. <laughs> what a simple ploy! Putting such an enormous price on something of that nature! Long live Her Majesty! <laughs> it's too bad, really. Cause now I won't get to discover what your actual name is. So, Emelman, you shall remain. Jeez, what a weirdo. Bearing 7 o'clock. Range, three quarters of a mile. It's a cave racer. <sighs> Woohoo! You guys Check were out great the losers! Here. Yeah! You're back sooner than I expected. Hey, now! What's the big idea ditching us back there? Yeah, why'd you guys leave without us? Yeah! I didn't think we were gonna make it back! Yes, Lobby! <laughs> Did you win? Uh, yeah. They're making a party. A party sounds wonderful. <laughs> it's that guy. Well, hello again, everyone. Sister Delfina has ever said that to me. Cause you're weird, and you keep calling Klaus Emelman. Yes, but Emelman is Emelman, and you are Alvis. Huh? Next 
first episode of Last Exile, develop. What lies deep within the furthest reaches of the skies? <laughs>